Hello guys, welcome back. In this video I will show you how to create Facebook page. The process is similar for Android and iOS devices. Be sure to watch the video to the very end, so you don't make any mistakes. And of course, do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. So let's begin. And first, open up Facebook app. Then right there hit add menu icon at android devices that menu icon can be located right there at top right corner once you opened menu first you have to do is hit right there where it says pages to open up your pages list and right here you can easily find create feature just tap on that to start creating your page Hit on get started and the first you have to do is enter your page name. You can just tap at that text field and then just put in here some name for your page. Once you finished, you can hit add next. There you have to select a category for your page. A category will help people to find this page in search results. You can add up to three different categories. You can select categories from suggested and also you can tap there and then just start typing any text. It shows you suggested results and from here you can select any of them. Once you finished with that, hit on create. And after a short time I have created the page and now we can add more details to help people to connect with you. So first you can add there some bio. Just as regular text type in here whatever you want. After that you can add contacts, website, email address and phone number. Also, you can add location. You can just tap at city, it brings up some kind of search and then you can just start typing any location, let it be New York, I will select uh, them from suggested and also here you can enter your uh, exact address and exact postcode as a regular text. Once you finished with that, you can scroll down and set up work hours. Work hours information helps people to know your location's hours. Uh, if no hours available, you can select that option. If your business is always open, you can select that one. If you have standard hours, you can pick that option. And now you can set up it more detail. So by default, in each day it's uh, marked as closed. You can check mark Monday. And now you can set up the period of time when your business is working. You can hit right there and set from time in that simple way. And also you can set two time. Also, you can add there some additional hours. In the same way, you can set up each day and then hit on done. After that, you can hit on next. Now you can customize your page. You can set a logo here or any other picture. Just hit at that photo icon and then you can select any photo from your camera roll. Let it be that one. Also, in the same way, you can select a cover for your page. Once it finished, you can edit action button. You can just tap where it says edit action button. That moves you to that page where you have to tap on try it. Action button allows people to engage with you by customizing the action button at the top of your page. So by default message option is selected so anyone are able to connect with you via Facebook Messenger. But you can switch this option to let's say WhatsApp message or call now or send email, contact us and a lot of other different options. You can hit right here for example to send a WhatsApp message and on the next step you would be able to connect your WhatsApp account to your Facebook profile. I will keep Facebook Messenger here and I'll tap on next. Then I can hit on save and now I can tap at next button again. 
That moves me to the next step, where I can add my WhatsApp account to that Facebook profile page. I can add it right now or I can just skip that step. Here we are able to invite our friends to that page. I can hit right here at invite friends. And then in that simple way, just by check marking my friends, I can send invitations to all of that friends just by hitting on send invitations button. I can close it for now and hit on next. And now on the last step, I have to set up which types of notifications I want to get about that page. By default, both of these options toggled on, I can just hit at that switchers to toggle it off or I can keep it turned on. Then I'll just hit on done and basically that's all about how to create Facebook page. Now you can write down in the comments below if you have any questions about that tutorial and also I recommend you to check out my Facebook tutorials playlist where you will find a lot of useful Facebook tutorials. Now you can hit the like button if you like that video and I'll see you in the next one.